Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard-earned money on Madden packs? Well, look no further than my sponsor, MMOEXP, for the cheapest and the most reliable mug coins on the market. And don't forget to use code FURTY at checkout for 5% off. The link for their website will be right at the top of the description. Are you looking to take your Madden game to the next level? Look no further than Sybil.gg for the best ebooks on the market. Choose one of two membership options, and don't forget to use code FURTY at checkout for 25% off. What's going on guys for the second stocking stuffer gameplay of the day we are looking at the brand new Antonio Gibson if you did miss the earlier gameplay the CD lamb gameplay we'll leave a card for that video in the top right right now before we hop into it though about half you guys who watch the videos are actually not subscribed so if you right now watching this is not subscribed with notifications on make sure you go ahead and do that so you don't miss a single gameplay a single tier list or a single upload Okay, so real quick before we hop into Antonio Gibson's stats, while I was recording the CD Lamb gameplay, I didn't know that there was a stocking stuffer strat card. So real quick, I do want to show you guys how you guys can go ahead and get that strat card for yourself. Um, I did mention that, yes, the zero chill strat cards do not work on these cards, but they do have their own, their own strat cards. So you kind of have to pick or choose if you want to run with the zero chill one or if you want to use the stocking stuffer one. It's really easy. Just go to the stocking stuffer solos. And then all you need is 30 stars. So 30 stars right here. And you, get, and you do get the gift wrap strategy, which I do believe is plus one speed and then plus three to all stats compared to the zero chill one. That is plus one speed and then plus two to all stats. So honestly, I mean, it does make sense that's plus three because if you, if you are going to use a bunch of those 92 overall cards, I'm um, having the plus three is going to make them obviously much better. And also at 50 stars, you do get a free NCAT 92 overall stocking stuff or two. And there honestly are some pretty good names um but like the safety on the jaguars wind guard tracy tracy walker i believe his name is even this gibson card you have cd lamb you have jc jackson guys like that that are all really gonna benefit from getting plus one speed and then plus three to all their ratings which is still ridiculous to me okay so here is antonio gibson and yesterday when i saw that gibson was getting a card i knew 100 percent i'd be doing this gameplay today because i just love antonio gibson in real life so yeah i want to i want to try this card out i want to do it i've been waiting for his i've been waiting for another gibson upgrade this year i'm not sure i don't remember actually if i did a gibson gameplay earlier in the year i want to say that maybe i didn't do one earlier this year i i may have i don't remember i just don't at all but i know he had that team builder card earlier in the year which was pretty solid when he first came out oh my controller almost just fell down but it was, it was pretty solid when he first came out but yeah, Gibson, this car is pretty good. 93 speed, 93 acceleration. People kind of forget that Gibson is, I mean, people know that he's six foot, but people kind of forget that he also does weigh 230 pounds. So yeah, 228, six foot. Gibson, kind of a bigger body, also good break tackle. Decent truck, decent stiff arm, but yeah, good carrying, good spin. I mean, decent spin, good juke, good COD, and also a pretty good pass catcher too with 80 catching and 81 short route running. And I usually don't talk about traits whenever we're going over the card in the intro, but there is one trait on this Gibson card that does just scare me a little bit. It does scare me a little bit. I mean, the stats look good. If you, if you are able to get that stocking stuff or, uh, you know, that stocking stuff or whatever it's called, stocking stuff or uh, strat card, um, that'll definitely help him out a whole lot too. I mean, we're talking about plus three on all of his stats besides speed, obviously, but still pretty ridiculous. But if we head down here, look at this trait right here. Covers the ball, brace against the medium hitter. So, He's not bracing against big hitters, which is definitely concerning. Um, if you are getting tackled by a guy who has that big hitter trait on yes, that means he's not going to cover the ball, which means he's going to fumble a lot, I think. Like, I don't know what this means because even on a guy like, look, here's Tavon Austin's traits, for example. He has brace for all hits. Yes, his carry isn't as good, but at least he's bracing for all hits. So a little bit concerned about that. We're going to have to see how that kind of plays out throughout today's gameplay. And if you do keep using this card it could end up being a problem so just know that you know this card could potentially have some ball security issues which i'm hoping that he does it and this is actually the first time on a running back i've seen this trade on all year so i don't know i have no experience with this trade either so i have no idea how it's gonna play we have to find out if he does fumble a bunch today then i guess we know why for gibson's abilities we are ro we are going to be rocking today with freight train in the x factor i have energizer in slot number two and then i have spin cycle in the third slot i feel like that's probably better than evasive um i did want to save an ap i mean if you like spinning and juking i feel like evasive is actually very relevant this year um i feel like it was really obviously really relevant in madden 20 because it completely changed when your running back played but i feel like in this year's game the spin and the juke are low-key kind of back so 
I don't hate the evasive energizer combo. And if you don't want to run energizer, I mean, evasive by itself by itself still does work very well. But today, like I said, spin cycle and energizer on Gibson and powered up. I don't think he, that he gets any new abilities. I will check though. And I don't believe that he does. I don't think so. So those are uh, Gibson's abilities. Let's hop into the gameplay. Like I said, I'm a big Gibson fan in real life. So I'm definitely excited for this one. Let's hop into it. All right, here we go. Uh, game number one. My opponent actually has a pretty good team. There's our top three. We got Ty Law, Calvin Johnson, Jamal Adams, and his name is Dr. Hold That. So kind of a cool name. I, I kind of like that name. I'm not even going to lie. Might be kind of a sweaty one here this morning. We're starting off on offense. Um, the Jets did get some new offensive line love today. So I do have the brand new Greg Van Roten card. And I did move Deerdorf over to right tackle. So no more Kelvin Beecham. I still do have Alan Fanica. Um, I might use a cheat on him, honestly. I'm kind of considering going to get Walter Jones, but I don't know if I actually want to do it. I don't know if I want to spend the coins for him, but I'm really considering it. Just know that I'm really thinking about doing that. And let's try going with a nice little like little out here. This play could set up pretty well if we just put him on this, him like this. And I kind of put him on a corner out. It might might work pretty well. Let's go with this. Get, get out, Gibson. Oh my, look at the speed getting on the back. There's the spin cycle. Oh, okay. He kind of just stood there. I don't know what that was very easy spin that back low key there we go oh, I, want, I tried swerving that i really did so we do get a first down kind of a slow start though which i don't really i don't like slow starts i don't but well, here we go let's try getting off the edge here deardorf selling already deardorf do i like kelvin better why is deardorf kind of stalling out there try it again is he gonna have a good gap no we're not we have a free lead blocker make a miss oh i tried i should have spawned i tried juking and all i oh look at the oh look at the shed that he just got all right all right, all right. we gotta figure something out here Hopefully, we don't have that problem today. I mean, outside. There we go. Good. Oh, kind of a bad. On a, I mean, I have Polar Elite on a corner to kind of have that block. Just wasn't good enough. I mean, I might need to spin back, but we'll see how he... Oh, beautiful blocking. Good hole. Get me up. Okay, there we go. The Cam Chancellor, he's a big hitter. I, it's one man I should definitely be fearing right now. Gibby here. And that might play a lot better. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Wow. Make a... Oh, we're getting ankle tackled by a corner? And he is and Croft's wide open. There we go. Fall, fall. Okay, good job, Tyler. Tyler Cross been kind of balling for us today. Showing up in big spots. Showing up in, in honestly, huge spots today, man. I may have to spin back here, but we should have... Is that Tyree? Yo. Am I tripping right now? Yo, yo, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. I, I know I'm not... I know I'm not delusional, right? That was Tyree kill on defense, right? Bro, he's got Tyreek with runoff elite. Dude, what am I playing right? Look at the pancakes, man. Look at the... He got, if he got up and tackled me, there would have been a problem. Tyreek on defense? Like, at, at, the, at the end of the half, obviously. Is he going to scream? He didn't scream. He should actually have Y open. Get it there. Get broke. Okay, wait. Hold up. Spin that. Good job. And um, I'm going to try to chew as much clock as possible right here. Six, five, four three and i didn't score i didn't score yo that happened to me before that has happened to me before that has happened to me before i'm not gonna lie oh no yeah we got it all right dude that was so scary the maker okay he's he might quit that i'd be pretty pissed if jamal adams just teleported too yep okay let's get another game though man let's get another game all right here we go i did miss my opponent's top three I, I i missed it i was reading comments from the last video so yeah if you come on the last video i'm gonna give some shout outs real quick hey shout out to joker shout out to ebk shout out to oh sh oh no oh no oh no oh no get out of bounds shout out to maximus maximus whitmire um shout out to manuel shout out to Payne. shout out to packer farmer shout out to um Dion jones flipping one step at a time shout out to him too man so um shout out to y'all who commented on the cd lamb gameplay for real but hey this is we're here for antonio gibson let's get back to running the rock the right way man let's get right back to it we didn't run the ball that well i'm not gonna lie that one drive that we had with gibson didn't run the ball that well we had a we were much better at pass catching there but yeah here we go little uh okay give me a okay never mind D didn't have it didn't just just don't have it right now just not running the ball well cover six hard for me to force feed getting hit sticked but spin that back oh and broke a tackle that is deon sanders so kind of mickey mouse let's let's no huddle flip it same play same setup here we go he should get he should be looking a little bit cross-eyed here yep he is looking very cross-eyed spin that my i'm not hitting my spins today that's the problem i'm not hitting my spins today uh, that's what's that's what's going on right now i'm just not hitting my spins the way that, that i should be hitting them it's simple as that i'm just not 
Juszczyk's probably better than Croft after the catch, low key. So we have our puller now, picking up, picking up dudes up. There's a little juke in there. We go, Gibby. Go, Gibby. Go, run. Dude, he's so fast. We have the corner. Let's go, man. Let's go. By the way, this is literally naked Gibson, like 93 speed Gibson. No speed boost at all. I don't have the strat card. So if you have a Washington team and the strat card and power them up, I mean, I mean, the card can just get so much better. But I love his animations. Um, like I said, we haven't been lined up yet. So I don't know how the medium hitter thing is going to work out. I don't know. If anyone has had any problems, please comment that down below. But most likely you're not watching this video if you already have the card. But I don't know. It's kind of a weird scenario with this guy, but he does feel really good. We finally did break a big run. Is he playing? Yeah, he was. He was. He was. He was playing the wheel. Pick your poison, man. Who, who you want? Okay, you're going to play man. Okay, we should have Gibson open. And, uh, not Gibson. Uh, use check. Sorry. Use check. Nice play. Three for three for Boomer. 40 yards. That was a kind of a big fourth down, though. Hooking against man coverage. And we should actually get Gibson open here. Give me the corner. He tried jumping it with Parsons. And I finally get a good spin. There we go. I set my shoulders, got around them, and easy first down right there for Gibson. Is it man? It's not man. Missed the wheel route. And we should have a free walk in here with Gibby. Score Gibby. We're over the top of Wingard for Gibson's third drive of the day and his third TD of the day. Um, we did technically go four drives, so technically three for four. But Gibson felt really good. Unfortunately, didn't get hit stick today, so I don't know about the medium hitters thing. But yeah, hopefully that isn't a problem. I really hope it's not. All right, guys, so that is going to do it for the Antonio Gibson gameplay. I kind of said all I wanted to say about this card already, but all I'm going to say is that EA just added 2x chems on these cards. So now they have 2x chems. That wasn't like that in the intro. At least I don't think it was. I don't I don't think it was, but yeah, 2x chems on Gibson. That means 2x chems on, you know, all these cards that came out today. So a big W for EA. Also, you know, the, the uh, stocking stuff or strat card. So the card you saw today, Gibson, was basically naked. I mean, I didn't even have him powered up. All I had was the ability. So you could potentially, if you want to power him up and then throw the strat card on him, have a plus four on, on all your stats that you're, that you're going to see on Gibson. That means plus two speed as well. So yeah, the, the Gibson you saw today was playing very well. Just imagine that with, you know, plus two speed and plus four to every single stat, which is just kind of ridiculous. So Gibson, definitely a card I recommend if you have a Washington team. Even if you don't have, you know, even if you don't have, a Washington team, I still think if you're like a budget or no money spent team, this card's a really good option right now because of the strat card. And yeah, I, I do like this card a lot. Also, his size is good. The weight's good. was breaking tackles very well. So yeah, if you are still watching, let's comment the train emoji for a chance to be shouted out in the next video. And if you are new here, hit that subscribe button. And as always, I will see you boys in the next one.